Hi. There are wonder many wonderful treatment options for those who fight to overcome the grip of opioid addiction. We have made it our mission to create an outlet for the family members of addicts. We want to provide support and encouragement for those that feel the secondhand repercussions of the opioid ep ep epidemic. Addiction hits home for all of us. We named our project Yours, Mine and Ours because we all have experienced the epidemic in some way. You have your story, I have mine, and together we share ours. It is our goal to break the cycle of addiction starting with the youth of Eastern Kentucky. So our plan of action, uh, we held a conference at our high school on April 9th, which was Monday. That's, <clears throat> that's the reason why we sent the wrong PowerPoint stuff. So um, we invited Randall Kraft. He is a graduate of McGoffin County High School. He was an addict uh, since he was 16, and he has been clean for two years. He works for ARC. He is a peer, um, a peer support counselor at ARC. And um, we invited him and his colleagues to come and share their stories at our high school. We also demonstrated a human graph, which means we pulled students from the audience to show how many people die per day by drug addiction, which was four. And like to get up there and see them kids stand up there, 28 of them, that's a whole classroom at our high school. That was kind of crazy. So, And um, we, uh, we also provided sheets. To, for our students to fill out, to write their own story down, and we created a journal full of them sheets. That's just a few of them. We, uh, we threw a lot of them out that wasn't dealing with directly like opioids. We had some with alcohol and other stuff. So uh, go on to the next one. And there's our journal. And we also created an app, and Jaden's going to tell you more about that right now. Uh, this is from our conference. Uh, this is our human graph right here. That's our school popu- uh, our school, what word am I looking for? This is just our school. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is Randall, uh, and this was the speaker for ARC, their public speaker. Go on. Um, so, everybody has an addiction story. Everybody in this room has been affected. <sighs> okay, no, go back. So, there are many wonderful options for the treatment recovery, but we wanted to make an outlet for the family members. Um, with help from Bit BitSource from Pikeville, Kentucky, we developed an app for the family members who battle the secondhand repercussions from the opioid epidemic. Our app provides quick links to different websites for support and guidance to overcome the stigma of addiction. YMO stories can be downloaded for free on both the Google Play and Apple Store. It's not on Apple yet, but we're working on it. <laughs> Uh, this is a screen recording of our app. Okay, this is our home page. These are our support tabs and different links. There are chat rooms and different things like that. This is ARC's website. This is about us. It's our mission statement. Contact us. That's our high school. If anybody wants to contact us, just call our school and you can talk to our leader. She's not here today, but. <laughs> and that's our stories tab. Yeah, we're going to add personal stories on there too. If anybody wants to add theirs, just let us know. Oh, yeah, we have a Dropbox outside on our table if you want to donate your anonymous story. And that's it. <laughs>